So this chart gives me an indication of what size nozzle I need, absolutely. But also too, it's important to remember that the compressor selection that you make has to be able to provide adequate air to facilitate the appropriate outcome of this particular nozzle. So on the side of the chart where it nominates efficiencies, you're looking for efficiency of 100%, of course you are. So consequently it'll go across for a number seven and tell you that you need 312 CFM of air. So a 400 CFM compressor would adequately do a number seven nozzle with the blast helmet, which will take about 30 CFM of air to run at, at optimum. So if you don't have the appropriate air to run that number seven nozzle, you are wasting your time trying to blast with, with inadequate air. So what I suggest you do is come back in nozzle size, which reduces the CFM requirement for that particular nozzle to appropriate this, the appropriate outcome as far as blasting is concerned. Not enough air, wasting your time. Come back in nozzle size, reduce the orifice size of the nozzle, which backs holds up the air, which enables you to the appropriate velocity to achieve the class of blast that you're after.